Hey guys, I'm John Biggs with TechCrunch. Every year at CES, Scott Jordan, CEO of Scotty Vest, comes out, and uh, this time he's brought something crazy with him. This, what is this? This is a Polaris slingshot, <laughs> which I've renamed the Pocket Man machine. Right. It's actually technically a motorcycle. So we're going to get inside this thing, drive around, you're going to tell us all about Pocket Man and how Scotty Vest is doing. I'm looking forward to Let's it. Let's give it a Let's try. Let's do it. So, so what are we doing in this car? Why, 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 why'd you put me in here, Scott? Yeah, John, <laughs> uh, this is my vehicle to promote myself and my book and my brand. It's the Pocket Man machine. And I, when it came out, I thought it was the coolest thing around. It's actually not a car. It's a motorcycle, mm -hmm. technically. Which is why we're wearing these delightful, uh, this delightful headgear. It's uh, made by Polaris, and it's the most fun I've ever had in a vehicle. And I'm traveling around the country, starting at the Consumer Electronics Show and moving on to LA and then San Francisco and talking to people about Scotty Vest, my passion, which is what my book is about, Pocket Man, and how I started my company. And I thought, what better way to do it than be as outrageous as possible in this vehicle, which is truly outrageous, mm -hmm and get out and talk to people. And I'm meeting tons of people, it's awesome. So you've been doing uh, this sort of clothing. So your, your, your main bag is basically connected clothing. So you've got clothing with pockets, uh, you can put iPads, you can put phones and things in there. And you've been doing this for 14 years now, right? That's right, we, we were the first brand to start on the internet um, back in 2000. And we've grown exponentially since then. And mm -hmm. what I've d decided was to figure out how to design clothes to carry all the electronic devices that you and I carry with us and do so without looking like a dork. Mm -hmm. So we put pockets and we engineer clothing with tons of pockets and innovative features that no one else has been thinking about, even after all this time, which kind of blows me away a little bit. I thought there'd be a lot more people. People put like a, a cell phone pocket, but we've been designing pockets for iPads the day the iPads came out and all the wiring and technology so you can use your headphones and power your devices right inside your clothing. And it's, it's a perfect vehicle because in this car, or motorcycle technically, there are no pockets. There's no hood, there's no I compartments. I can't put my phone anywhere. Yeah. <laughs> so, so how has the industry changed? You've been, you've been doing this, this, connect, this sort of clothing for 14 years. What, were they, what did they say when you first started, when you wanted to put a bunch of zippers and stuff in there? Because 2000, we weren't really carrying gadgets around. I guess we had PDAs and we had big phones. Uh, 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 yeah, they, pagers, and this was pre iPod. Yeah, yeah. Um, you know, I, I bumped into two sorts of people because I was a successful attorney before I started, and this is what my book Pocket Man covers: is you know, is how did I start this clothing brand based upon this philosophy of pockets? People thought I was either crazy or they got it. There was no <laughs> in between. And you know, to quit my successful legal career and start designing clothing with its unique feature being pockets and wiring systems, you know, it's kind of crazy. So I love gadgets at, at, at its core. I'm a, a huge TechCrunch fan and Gizmodo fan and mm -hmm. any new devices, as you can see, I've got them <laughs> all. And and I love Vegas. This is perfect for yeah, to promote a, a brand. And, and one of the things I talk about is, um, you know, basically uh, how you attach yourself to other brands to, to, to further your own brand. In this case, mm -hmm. you know, Polaris. So yeah, they've you, got a great product. Do you product. still think you guys are a startup, or what are you guys now? Oh, I, you know, what is a startup? Yeah. I mean, you know, we've been around for 14 years. You know, we, you know, we have no outside investors. No, We have no exit strategy. It's just my wife and I own all the, all the stock. We have no debt. We've been profitable since our second year. We, we run our business as if it were a startup. Every day matters. We've been profitable from day one, and it's important that we maintain that, that sense. So we're here to build a lifestyle brand around you know, people who carry a lot of stuff and want a way to do it. Mm -hmm. So there are a bunch of companies that are essentially lifestyle companies. Uber, HelloFresh. They're essentially trying to recreate the Google campus and uh, in the real world. 
So what kind of advice would you give a lifestyle brand to get people to keep buying shirts, to get people to keep using services uh, that they might not think they need, but once they start using it, they'll get a real big kick out of it? Well, you know, our biggest goal is to get people to try our stuff because I know once they try our clothing, it's paradigm shifting. They'll put on something else that doesn't have all the pockets and yep. they'll say, but my Scotty vest does, and they'll keep gravitating towards that. And for that reason, we have over 50% of our customers are returning customers mm -hmm. every single day. So we have a really high, um, high returning customer rate. But the, the point is, is to create a, a brand that is enduring, that people want to affiliate with. And uh, part, of, part of that is being done through this Pocket Man mm -hmm. uh, moniker, if you will. You know, it's something, it's fun. It's, the, you know, when the CEO goes out and they're as approachable <laughs> as I am and goes to all these events and when I'm traveling the country, it creates, a, it creates something you want to be a part of and uh, instead of just, just an item. Right. And, and, and that's, what, that's, what, that's our goal, is to create an enduring brand. All right, Scott, thank you very much for the ride. I don't think we can get out here, but we'll, uh, we'll keep at it. Look, we can wave right here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Scott Jordan, it's CEO just wherever you go. Look at it. Scotty Vest and the Pocket Man. Thanks a lot, John. It was fun.